hi there, students. A storm in a teacup. Okay, this is a British phrase. I believe the Americans say a tempest in a teapot. So what is a storm in a teacup? Okay, this is when people get really upset and really angry about something that's just not important. Okay, so imagine a teacup, a cup to drink tea, and you have a storm like you would in the sea with wind and rain. Okay, so this is a storm in a teacup. Okay, it's when people are angry about something that is really not relevant or not important. I was 10 minutes late for work yesterday and everyone was telling me off. Everybody was angry with me. I think it's just a storm in a teacup. I was only 10 minutes late, okay? So a lot of unnecessary bother about something that's really not important, yeah? Um, I, I didn't take my children to school on Monday because there was a party and I wanted to take them to it. And the teachers got really angry. The headmaster sent me a letter and they threatened me that I was not taking the, the school seriously. I think this is just a question of a storm in a teacup. They're making a storm in a teacup. Okay, so if somebody exaggerates a small problem and makes it seem far greater, far bigger than it really is, this is when we say they are making a storm in a teacup. They're making a lot of fuss, a lot of aggravation about something that really is insignificant. Okay, um, I don't know. For example... Uh, she did her washing and she washed the sheets and they were white but there was one black mark on one of the sheets and she got really upset and she was complaining and moaning about it all day to everybody this is just a storm in a teacup okay or with political events sometimes people get really upset about something politically but maybe it has no real significance at all. This is a storm in a teacup, okay? So, next time you have a small problem or a small difficulty, don't make a storm in a teacup about it, okay? So, there you go. A new phrase for your vocabularies. If you enjoyed the video, give it a rating, subscribe to my channel, and I'll see you soon. Bye for now.